Hello everyone, I'm VK from ServicesTutorials.com. Thank you for joining me in this video session. This video explains the steps to change Services Plus database from Postgres to MSQL. By default, Services Plus gets installed with Postgres database. If you ever wanted to switch to MSQL database, it is just a few steps away. Let's begin the process. This instance of Services Plus is configured with Postgres database and it has a data within it. Now stop the Services Plus service from Windows Services Console. Open the command prompt with administrative privileges and access the Services Plus bin folder. If you wanted to copy the Postgres data to MSQL, then execute backupdata.bat before changing the database. Otherwise, you could skip this step. The data backup is over. Now run the change db server.bat present under bin folder. It will pop up a database setup wizard. Choose a server type as SQL Server and fill in the SQL Server IP address, port number and SQL instance name. If you like to create a separate user account in SQL Server for Service Desk Plus, select the authentication type as SQL Authentication and provide DB Creator, Public and Sysadmin roles. Click on the test button, ensure the connection is successfully established and then save the configuration. It would create a database called Service Desk on your SQL Server. Now start the Services Plus service from Windows Services Console. The application will be accessible after a few minutes, but there won't be any data within it. To restore the backed up data, once again stop the Services Plus service. Open the command prompt with admin privileges and access the Services Plus bin folder. Execute restoreData.bat and choose the latest backed up file present under Services Plus Backup folder. Now start the Services Plus service from Windows Services Console. The application is accessible now. We have successfully migrated to MSQL database. Thank you for watching this video. Subscribe to our channel for more Services Plus related videos. Stay tuned.